channel so today i'm gonna to be doing a mini haul i got a few things from ross burlington and something from pretty little thing so i'm gonna jump right into it and show you what i got first thing i got from ross was this denim dress i think it is so cute it's stretchy and it's very fitting price on this was $8.99 let me show y'all hopefully it focused so i'm still trying to get used to this camera yeah so it was $8.99 Really cute, and I got this in the size large. I got this dress also from Ross. I have been loving denim lately. If you follow me on Instagram, you know that I got the denim Jordan 6s that I have worn quite a few times since I bought them. So I thought that this denim dress was cute as well. And I got it in the size medium because this was the biggest that they had. So either I'm gonna have to lose weight or I'm gonna have to, you know, squeeze up in this thing. Again. Nothing new, nothing changed, same old shit. But yeah, and this one was $14.99. I think it's so cute, and the waist is cinched, like it has that stretchy material, but the dress itself is just regular denim, it's not stretchy. So yes. Cute. The next item I got from Ross was this Perfect Nudes uh, Lip Gloss Collection. It's not by any particular name brand that I've ever heard of, but it's by Beauty Evolved. And I think they're really pretty. These are the colors, and I'll try to do swatches for y'all to see like the actual colors that they are. Okay, so I just tried on one of the liquid lipsticks, and this one is in the number two, and I have it on, and it smells like candy, like it has a sweet smell to it, so can't beat it for the price. Well, speaking of makeup, um, they had this Pro Fusion Face 41 Piece Full Face Palette at Ross as well. Basically has eye shadows, it has blushes, it has highlight, a light bronze, shadow bronze, brow wax, whatever that is. I think that goes like underneath the brow to like highlight it. Um, they have that in the medium brown, dark brown, and I think these are lip colors at the bottom. So the price was $8.99, and I thought it would be a good starter kit for me since I'm just now getting into makeup. I don't wanna go out and buy like these high-end branding makeup when I don't know what I'm doing. So I thought it would be something, you know, simple for me to practice with. So the eyeshadows aren't that pigmented, but again, I, it's just a basic, you know, starter kit for me to practice with. So I'm actually wearing one of the things that I got from Burlington. It was this BB sweater. It's really cute. I love, 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 love apple green or lime green, whatever color you want to call it. So yes, and I forgot how much this was. I wanna say it was like maybe $9.99. Also got two purses from there. I got this cute little BB bag. It just looks like this. This is the inside of the bag. The rest of this bag was $17.99. Y'all probably think it's a lot, you know, it's just a simple little bag, but BB is not as popular as it used to be, but it was once upon a time a good brand. So maybe that's why it was a bit on the you know pricier side for bags like this. So I didn't mind, and I still think it's hella cute. So the last thing I got from Berlin, so I only got two things. And this is what it looks like. It has these two little gold handles here, and it also has a strap. I thought this was like the cutest bag. Yeah, I know like a few years back, like burgundy was like all the craze. Like I bought so many burgundy shirts, cardigans, and I was like, you know what? I don't have any bags to match any of those clothes that I never actually wore. So I needed something, and when I saw this, I was like, oh my God, it's so cute. I think I'm just gonna wear it like without the, the this part and just wear it like with the handle. So I think it's cuter that way. And the price for this was $16.99. Let me show y'all the inside. The inside just says Mark New York. I don't know if this is like a, a, like a side brand of Marc Jacobs. I honestly don't know who Mark New York is or Andrew Mark, but I don't know. Either way, it's still a cute bag, so yeah, that's what I got. Last but not least, I ordered something from Pretty Little Thing. I only ordered one thing because I was unsure of the sizing, especially since the company is based in the UK, and most of the Instagram models that you see wearing Pretty Little Thing are like very small and petite, and I'm 5'10", 213 pounds, so. Biggest lady I've ever seen. Ah! 
That's a huge bitch. So, you do the math. So I ordered a sweatshirt, this baby pink sweatshirt, and it just says pretty little thing on the front. I love the aesthetic of it. It's very simple, it's very me, and pink is my signature color. Yes. I got it in a size large. It's like really, really big. I thought it was really cute, and I'll have the price on the screen because I don't remember it off the top of my head. That was all that I purchased um, during this little mini haul. I didn't want to go out and buy too many things because as y'all know, I'm on the road to saving $10,000 for 2020, so I'm buying minimal things here and there, and if I do have a little bit of money left over at the end of the month, then I splurge a little bit with that money. So if you have any questions about any of the items that I've shown, please let me know in the comment section below. Be sure to give this video a big thumbs up, share it, like it, watch it all the way to the end. If you made it this far, I want you to comment more hauls, please. Be sure to stay tuned for my next giveaway. It's going to be at 5,000 subscribers. I'm so thankful for all the subscribers I currently have right now. But yeah, we trying to do it big for 2020. So until next time, I will see you in my next video. Bye.